What's going on everyone? Back with another box opening today. I got a blaster of 2021 Topps Chrome off of eBay. Um, I think they're going to start going up in price with um, some of these younger guys starting to take off. So figured I'll give it one more try to try to hit a Dylan Carlson or a Jazz Chisholm. Ryan Mountcastle, one of those, one of those big guys. Um, none of them are super um, taking off. That jazz has been pretty electric so far, um, but I figured I like these blasters. You get a, a lot of good parallels, not numbered necessarily. But you got a chance to get a numbered card, um, but you get like the. The refractors and the X-fractors, the sepias, the pinks. It's a lot of good unnumbered parallels, which is what I'm looking for for some of those um, younger guys, rookies. Um, but I did want to start off the video. Um, I got some. I want a uh, giveaway done by Lively Card Collector. Um, go check out his YouTube channel. He sent me. A few of his cards in one of his basketball breaks actually and i don't do a ton of basketball opening but um i do follow the nba and it's pretty stoked to found out i won um so i'll see see what he sent me um got it's like you don't want to show that oh, it's like on both sides i think i got some extra stuff cool and this uh big card saver here Pull this up. All right, put that off to the side. I got a few other ones in here too. Awesome. Look at that, Tyrese Maxey. He's he's very nice. He's having himself a good playoffs for the Sixers right now. Hey, that's awesome. Did not expect that. What else we got in here? Yeah, we got Anthony Edwards too. Oh my God, <laughs> he's hooking me up. For real. Another Maxi. Oh, that's awesome. I really like that. That's sick. And then the one that I, the only one I thought I was getting, which is also an awesome card. It's a Jalen Green rookie card, but we've got a few very nice bonuses in there. So thank you, uh, Lively Card Co Collector. I appreciate it. Love your videos. Um, just give off the best vibes and, and enjoy um watching you go in the stores and hunting trying to get those those uh trying to find those cards um it's definitely good to watch someone else do it from a different perspective and see different strategies and all of that um yeah also opens i saw a few videos of him opening uh cards at an angels game which is pretty cool um with the background of a game going on that's like that's like a dream um, opening card sitting in, I'm sure, LA is just perfect weather. Um, here in Boston with like 40 degrees, feels like 30. It's still end of April and it's still pretty brutal. But yeah, go check out his channels. Um, always, I think, posting weekly, more than weekly, but hey, he's got some, good, got some good stuff. So thank you again. Um, all right, so I'll start getting into this top group chrome blaster box pretty excited about this i think this is definitely my uh favorite product um to come out of 21 this is expensive i think i got it for like 35 plus tax but like 38 which isn't horrible i think they're selling it in stores for like 40 um and then blasters in previous years you just forget it that stuff is unaffordable um for what you get out of it so we'll see what we get out of here. Get four cards per pack. Um, kind of hit a lull for a while in the card card game. Um, series one being out for like two months and no other real interesting releases in my opinion. Um, you got the, um, what is it? I don't know why I'm blinking right now, but Nothing, nothing that interests me too much. Heritage, yeah. 
Heritage, I'm not a big fan of. I don't really like the, the product, just in my opinion. All right, get going with some Topps Chrome. There's a Jackie Bradley Jr. Back on the Red Sox. There's a cup card of Kwang Hyung Kim. All right, and I think we have our first X-Fractor. Really hope it's something good. Looks like a pitcher. Dallas Keuchel. Still pretty nice. I love these X-Fractors. They're just such pretty cards. This one isn't worth much, but I just, it just looks good. Oh, and then we got a Seep. Ooh, Sepia Kirilov. That's nice. I'll take that and sleeve that up for sure. Kirilov, I think he might be hurt. I'm not sure. But definitely be following him a little closer now. <laughs> this card. That sleeved up. Top loaded. You can finally start using these top loaders. Is it the Series 1? Not getting anything I want to top load out of that. You get some luck, like hardly any numbered stuff. Wander's the only only rookie you want to top load, let alone Sleeve. You got like Marsh and a few other decent ones. But look at that. Alex Kirilov, Sepia. Very nice. If you can see that, okay. I got my backdrop over there. Awesome, that's a good pack. Good first pack, I like the start. This is why I like this stuff. You get got two parallels out of there. Both unnumbered, but still. Let's see what we got in here. There's a Mize. It's a pretty solid rookie. I think I see maybe a pink back. Darvish. Verdugo. I like Verdugo. It kind of looks like a refractor. That is. And the pink is John Means. Is that? I think that's a refractor of Verdugo. I like that. I'm a big Verdugo fan. I think John Means. Not a huge John Means fan, but he's solid. But Red Sox haven't been doing great lately. It's been kind of a bummer. Um, the league's pretty even though. I think there's only like the Reds are the only glaringly bad team, and then you got your normal dominant teams like Dodgers, Giants, who have been actually following. So they're just so interesting to me. Like they don't have they have good pitching, but like I feel like they have no overwhelming talent. There's a Blatty, Kiermaier. Cronenworth, it's pretty good. Take that for sure. A redo design. Um, yeah, I like to watch. I like to watch the West Coast teams. It's usually when I have the best shot at watching a game is later at night. So I'm so busy with everything. Couldn't open much cards lately. Have no time to go out looking for them or but I, I think it was a good good break from it I know we got some more good stuff coming out like Don Ross and uh, Bowman which I'm excited about Jimenez rookie Dansby Swanson and there's a Tony Gonsolin another sepia right there very nice Excited for uh, the new Topps Chrome that will come out. I don't know when, when that will be out, but um, maybe in like August or September. It's I'm seeing it's like fifty bucks pre-order a blaster. It's pretty crazy. Um, hopefully that doesn't hold true with like Target and stuff. But I think you can see me in this the reflection here. Kind of looks. Something weird. That like sign in the back. Very interesting. Is that a normal card? <laughs> I'll just put that to the side. Got a Devers. And Aranola. Refractor. Luis Robert. 
Future Stars. I was still looking for a Carlson Jazz. So those are my two main guys right now. I like, really like that Kirilov. Still looking for some more rookies though. One of those top ones. Joey Bart's pretty decent. I didn't think he would, I thought he would be a bust, but that giant system for some reason is just pumping out good players. I don't know how they do it, but there's Trevor Story. Madrigal. It's a good rookie. My rookie pile. Woodruff. And there's the other pink, Correa. So no rookies from the pinks, but we did get that sepia. We got two packs left. See if we can get any fire out of here. See if we can get anything uh, numbered. Maybe an autograph. Nolan. It's a throwback one. I thought he was in a Cardinals uniform. There's a Venezuela. I like Bohm. He's been kind of off and on this year, but still collectible. Still a decent potential. This fielding is just really bad. Same with the whole Phillies team. All right, we're on to our last pack. Let's have some last pack juice out of here. Come on, let's get something good. Colors, oh, and an ad comes on right as I do this. All right, this song is called Home, so bring me home, something nice. Bryant, and I got something shiny behind him. Oh, Shohei Refractor, that's pretty cool. I like that. And a Whit Merrifield. Is that a sepia? Did I get three sepias? I can't tell. I don't know. <laughs> there you go. I think the star of the show right here is this Kiro off sepia. It's very nice. It's a good card right there. And then got some of the nice 86 redos of Bohm, Cronenworth. So pretty decent. Um, did get an X Fractor, but not who I was looking for. Um, and then I'd say, other than that, this, this Shohei refractor is pretty good. And then whatever the heck this is, I don't know why this is so shiny. <laughs> you can literally see my face in this, but all right. Thank you all for watching.